Hello all of you prestigious peeps out there, it is me, Prestigious PG, back with another video, and today I've got a, well, interesting topic to talk about, and that is the possibility of a, well, a DLC for a certain game. Now, give me just a second and I'll show you which one I'm talking about. This one, Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu. But you're probably wondering, what kind of DLC am I talking about? Has to do with this, Pokemon Adventures of the Orange Islands. Now, I'm sure you're probably wondering, what does the Pokemon Orange Islands DVD have to do with Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu? Let me explain, okay? Now, there are a lot of people who have uh, often wondered if the Orange Islands actually exist in the games, or if it's just exclusive to the anime. But, what if it's possible that the uh, Pokemon Company and Game Freak could possibly make a DLC of the Orange Islands in Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee? I think it would be a great way to really, you know, expand upon uh, Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee. It could have a handful of Johto Pokemon in it that, you know, from that, like Meryl, Togepi, and, um, also, when you reach Shamudi Island, if you have Moltres, Zapdos, and Articuno, uh, captured from Kanto, if you take them to Shamudi Island, it could trigger events where you could try to capture Lugia. I mean, think about that. And also, it could challenge the Orange Crew by traveling all over the Orange Islands, um, let's see, there was, uh, let's see, well, I kind of forgot some of the island names, but, of course, it would lead to the end to where you would challenge the Orange Crew Leader Drake and become the Orange Islands League Champion, and now, also, this could also include Tracy from the anime. Now, of course, he was, of course, an anime-exclusive character, but seeing as though how Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee has, you know, played tribute to the anime in a number of ways of Team Rocket and, and of course, you know, references to Ash and all, perhaps maybe they could, and of course, with Misty and Brock in it, perhaps they could uh, uh, include Tracy in the games and have him be sort of like a guide or something. And maybe battle him in the end. I mean, that could be a possibility. So yeah. Um, plus, we have seen DLC with, of course, Breath of the Wild with uh, Champion Ballad and Trial of the Sword and Splatoon 2 with the Octo expansion and Smash with the Smash Fighter Pass. So maybe they could do for Pokemon Let's Go Pikachu and Eevee the Orange Island episodes. And it'd be a good way to really, you know. Keep Pokemon fans happy on the Switch until Pokemon Generation 8 comes out pos uh, comes out this year. Um, I know uh, we still haven't seen any news about it lately, and but we're we're all it's anticipating the uh, reveal of Pokemon Generation 8. And of course, it is the beginning of February, which means only 26 days until Pokemon Day. Kind of makes you wonder if they might reveal Pokemon, uh, the new Pokemon games on Nintendo Switch on Pokemon Day. I mean, it could be possible. I mean, they did do Sun and Moon, uh, three years ago, the day before, in a Pokemon Direct, and they could possibly do it the same way. So, who knows what could happen. One thing's for sure, um, we're all excited to see any sort of news about Pokemon on Nintendo Switch. So, would you like to see an Orange Islands, um... Uh, in a Pokemon game like as DLC for Pokemon Let's Go well as always be sure to like subscribe for more videos and until next time be prestigious stay prestigious and I'll catch you guys next time